Hello everybody and welcome to Memphis, Tennessee on this November the 6th. It is approximately 72 degrees and there's the seven day forecast for Memphis. We've got lots of sun, some 70 degree weather, a couple of 80s in there and that night we're going to be in the 50s and 60s. It's a beautiful fall so far for Memphis. We call it the uh, Mid-South, I guess, of the United States. We have yet to have a frost, so everything is nice and green. As far as flowers, the Bermuda grass is going dormant. There's some Bermuda. It is going dormant. This is going to be my uh, fall video of the garden and how things do in Memphis. Throughout the uh, country, up north, I've seen videos where they've had snow and sleet and cold weather. In other parts of uh, Europe, I've seen some videos there where they're in springtime. Somewhere, somewhere I saw some springtime videos. But uh, anyway, here we're in the fall. And like I said, we haven't had a frost. So I'm just going to look at a few things. A banana tree. They are uh, at the end of their cycle here. This is the first year I've had one. There's actually two there now, but then it's not growing anymore. And uh, I will be, I guess, cutting it back here once we get our first frost and try to get it ready for next year. The hostas look nice and green for the fall. I got four of them. One, two, three, four. I cut them back in uh, August because they were sunburnt. I did a video on how to cut them back and uh, they grew back in about three weeks and now it's November and they're looking nice for the fall. So uh, they'll be good into the first frost which could be in a few weeks but uh, instead of being brown they're nice and green and it rewards you with a second batch of flowers. I always call it the second season. When you cut them back, same thing with this monkey grass. I cut it back, but that's about all I did. And so that's the banana tree, the hostas. We're going to walk over here to the geraniums. So far, they're looking good because I haven't had a frost, like I said. I got them in this planter, so when it looks like it's going to get cold, I'm going to take them in, try to uh, get them ready for next year. Hopefully the video does a good job on the color. This is like a bright fluorescent uh, pink or red. I'm, I'm not very good at describing colors. I guess that's a... I don't know. My wife always says I'm not good at it. But uh, to me that's like a bright pinkish red. But anyway, they're pretty. The very variegated monkey grass is uh, dormant really, it's not growing, but I don't cut, cut it back till spring. Irises I cut back a few, about a month and a half ago, they're growing. I will cut them back one more time for the winter, and then in the spring they get ready to bloom. And I'm going to walk out to the mailbox real quick. I'm going to do a, uh, oh, I planted a, uh, uh, Japanese maple there. I don't know if you see it. It wasn't my idea, but uh, anyway, it uh, I had to plant it. Yeah. Okay. Well, this is long enough. But anyway, that's my front garden tour. 